what's up guys and welcome to this tutorial so today I'm going to show you another one of the logic gates which is the OR gate so first of all by starting with the symbol of OR gate this is the symbol of uh, the OR gate in a schematic so this is its shape we have two inputs here A and B and we have the output Q and this is the truth table for the OR gate. So if any one of the inputs is logic high, so the output is also logic high. The only case that the output is logic low, if all of the inputs uh, are logic low, as we see here. By moving here down below, we have the IC of the two input OR it's 7432 and here we see that there is a small notch as we saw on the AND gate indicating that this is pen number one two three four etc so this is OR gate number one two three four so for the um, first OR gate, these are the two inputs of it and this is the output, two inputs output and so on. We have pin number 7 the ground pin and pin number 14 the VCC pin. So let's move to the breadboard. This is the OR gate IC here. As you see this is the notch this is pen number one two three etc so i'm going to plug this in here okay so let's connect pen number 14 to the vcc Pin number 7 to the ground the input number 1 to the ground input number 2 to the ground and finally the output in pen number three to the lead here so that's it let's turn on the power okay so now the two inputs are logic low so the output is low if one of the inputs uh, is high we see that the lead is on if both of them are high the output is high also the only case that the output is low when both of the inputs are low so that's it guys for the OR gate Thanks a lot for watching.